Welcome to Solutions Studio. This is a free series on C programming language. If you like these videos, please subscribe to follow along with this series. Also, please like and leave a comment and share the video to help spread this series. Hello and welcome back. And in this episode, we want to discuss about this copy to function that we used in this program. So this copy to function uses pointers and pointer arithmetics to copy the string in S2 to the character array in S1. Once again, all of the copy operation is going to happen here in the header of the far loop. And you can see that the header does not include any variable initialization because we do not need that. This expression that you can see in here will complete the whole copy operation for the strings. S2 and then once S2 has been dereferenced, it will be assigned to the location in S1. And once the assignment has been completed, both S1 and S2 will be incremented so that they both move to the next character. And when the assignment operation assigns the null character to S1, the assignment statement will return the null character as a return value and then this condition will become false and the for loop will terminate. And that's how the copy to function works. Stay tuned and I would like to see you in the next episodes.